Chemistry didn't start in a modern lab. Its roots go back 4,000 years to ancient Egypt, where people first made glass, extracted metals, and mixed perfumes. But real scientific chemistry was born in the Islamic Golden Age. This is Jabir ibn Hayyan, born in 721 CE in Tus, Persia, modern-day Iran. He grew up in a family known for science and scholarship. After political changes in Persia, his family moved to Kufa, Iraq, a center of knowledge during the Abbasid Golden Age. In Kufa, Jabir built the world's first real chemical laboratory and transformed alchemy into an experimental science. He invented distillation, crystallization, filtration, evaporation, and the famous alembic, a tool still used today. What made him different? He insisted on precise measurement, recorded results, and repeatable experiments, the foundation of modern chemistry. Jabir lived most of his life in Kufa and died there around 815 CE, leaving behind more than 3,000 scientific works. From a young Persian scholar to a scientist in Iraq, Jabir ibn Hayyan became the father of chemistry.